they're not wanting you out here because we do have a letter of trespass for all this property over here. The Zimmerman Martin case has arguably galvanized Sanford, Florida and the country along racial lines. Police and pundits alike have voiced concerns about the trial's potential to set off a firestorm in a city with a long history of racial division. I've actually been on the bus to where, you know, people have got into an argument, you know, and it was, you know, um, a, a white guy and a black guy. Incidents like the one described by Sanford resident April Brooks are what Police Chief Cecil Smith tells Soul of the South News are at the core of his city's racial problems. In speaking with the uh, people in the general public, that there has been a, um, a, an issue between the, 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 the blacks and whites for years. Uh, the, the issues between the police department and the black community for years. Chief Smith believes the fatal shooting of 17-year-old Trayvon Martin is what ignited a cause for conversation. The, the entire case has kind of um, brought some deep-seated issues that have been here for years. This isn't something that just occurred. Um, there have been uh, issues and concerns in the city of Sanford for quite some time. But the uh, interesting part is, is that now people are willing to talk about what those issues and those concerns are. Issues that have given the 52-year-old chief the responsibility of mending relations and soothing long-standing tensions. It's a mission that Smith embraced when he accepted the chief position in April. Part of it was the issue was that there was this huge disconnect. And so what we're trying to do is uh, reestablish that connection in different segments within the community. Smith is a career law enforcement officer who policed the Chicago suburb of Elgin, Illinois for the last 26 years. And Smith is the first to acknowledge changing attitudes and actions will take time. We got a new chief and everything, so that shows growth. So it's, it's hard out here for the cops because like people don't really have respect for cops. We've had numerous crimes that have uh, occurred in Sanford alone apart from Zimmerman and Trayvon that have not uh, gone to justice. They wanted to uh, change the administration in the police department. Had they not changed it, I wouldn't be here. They wanted to see, uh, uh, in many ways, uh, Mr. Zimmerman arrested. He was arrested. He was charged. They wanted to see a trial take place. The trial is now underway in a well-publicized case while a police department works to restore a community's trust. Reporting from Sanford, Florida, Jennifer Bisram, Soul of the South News.